Praise the Lord. Good morning. Let's listen to today's devotional by Brother James Benedict. I greet you in the wonderful and loving name of Jesus Christ. The topic for today's devotion, Our words define what we are. Or in the present IT scenario, our texts, be it WhatsApp or any text, will also reveal what we are. I've shared on this topic many a times. We pass in several areas of our life, but falter in this very area. The tongue, usage of tongue. Proverbs 18.21 Death and life are in the power of the tongue. You can bless people, you can curse people. Proverbs 15.1 A soft answer turneth away wrath, but grievous words stir up anger. We can, ex- we can uh, introspect our lives. How many times friction developed because of grievous words of the opposite person. Words are free, but how we use them costs us, is it not? Our words, as I said, can bless people. Our words can curse people. Proverbs 16.21 Kind words, gracious words are like honeycomb, sweet to the soul and health to the bones. But Proverbs 28, beg your pardon, Proverbs 12.18 and 19 The words of reckless pierce like swords, but the tongue of the wise brings healing. As I said, oftentimes words have a lot of power. With one word, we can break relationship. And with another word, where there is no relationship, it can be built. With few kind words, we can steadily develop relationship. But on the other hand, one wrong or hurtful or grievous word is enough. to lit a great war of friction and storm it is the best that can happen is to lose the debatable arguments and win the relationship but often times it happens that we win arguments but lose precious relationships so it's so important to be very careful not raising our voice but raising the value of our words will build healthy and fruitful relationship because it's rain that grows flowers but not thunder one good word is a gift it will repay good but one grievous or hurtful word is like a debt we need to pay interest words can plant gardens also words can burn large forests too what we eat may not remain in our stomach but what we say remains in our heart forever and so it's very important to think twice before we speak we use water regularly and we use our words to regularly but once they are used they cannot be retrieved to kill a person one weapon is enough but to kill an earth a mind just one hurtful grievous word is it when people come and shout without any proper reasoning let us just ignore them it's not the rupee notes which make noise but coins make noise where its value is insignificant what we are what we are is known by how we use our tongue on a day to day basis Help us, O oh Lord, to bring joy and sunshine into the lives of others by our words. We use instead of grief and sorrow. Lord, help us to ponder and Lord, uh, spend time in thy divine word to talk, to bless, and Lord, to speak gracious words. In Jesus' most loving name, we pray. Amen. Thank you for listening to today's devotional. God bless you. Have a blessed day. And always remember, Jesus loves you and cares for you.